What's going on everybody? I want to do a new series on my channel called The True Story Behind and then dot dot dot. It's going to be certain songs. So uh, let's start this week's episode out with Right Next Door to Hell, which is the first song on Use Your Illusion uh, 1. And you know, it's, uh, it's, it's got a very appetite for destruction kind of feel to it. And I'm going to talk a little bit about the history of it. I'm also going to link some videos that sort of shed some background on the song as well. So the actual song is about uh, Axl Rose's West Hollywood high-rise neighbor, Gabriel uh, Gabriella Cantor. So back in 1990, he got into an altercation with her. She basically had him arrested and sued, claiming that he hit her with a wine bottle. He denied, He basically denied the charges and said she was a, a fanatical fan who would always blast his music, always create a bunch of noise. And interestingly enough, that condo was actually given away that Axel lived in at the time in an MTV contest called Evict Axel Rose. So I've put the link to that video which showed the promo for the contest. Now, I don't know if it, anybody actually won the contest. I've never been able to find out. And much like a lot of the other songs that were on the Illusions album, uh, there was a lot of guest writers and this was one of those songs. So we actually had... Um, uh, a guest writer who once worked with Hanoi Rocks, who was a big influence on Guns N' Roses, uh, named Timo Kelto. Ke uh, so he's credited as one of the co-writers of the songs, along with Izzy and Axel. So apparently Izzy was over at Timo's house one day, and he played the chorus riff of the song while Stradlin was visiting, and that's sort of how the song came about. So, And then during the actual Use Your Illusion tour, I think especially during like, the early parts of the tour in 1991, they did play the song live several times. There's several live recordings. This one's probably the best-known one. This is from Indiana, uh, and then I think there's also a live recording from New York as well. So if you guys want to see live recording, I've also linked that down below. So that does it for this week's song. I'm not sure what I'm going to choose next. Um, if you guys have any ideas, let me know. And as always, guys, make sure you subscribe for the latest Guns N' Roses news sticker.